Dogma and ethos are inseparably connected. The Holy Apostle James, the brother of the Lord, says, Faith, if it not hath works, is dead, being alone. Thou hast faith, and I have works. Show me thy faith without thy works, and I will show thee my faith by my works. Faith is understood as a rule of life, not as a theoretical construct. If it is not applied in every aspect of life, it is like a skeleton without flesh. It is a bare-bones Christianity. There will end up if the holy canons be annulled, which explains and applied the gospel law in various cases. So in the ecumenical councils, we have the decisions of the ecumenical councils, the ori in Greek, which means boundaries, and you have the canons of the ecumenical councils. It's not an accident in our day that many people want to throw away the canons, this is the ethos, and they ignore the conciliar decisions, which is the boundaries of the church. These things are inseparable, and both of them become very tiresome for the secular Christian.